Hi guys, welcome to bed. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. If you've never seen my face before, hit the subscribe button and welcome to my channel. This is my channel. This is my little space on the internet. And I hope you're going to enjoy the information I have to give you today. So today we're going to talk about 10 things that you're doing that are aging your skin. I mean, honestly, to be honest, most of you guys are going to be like, uh, I'm below 25 years. That can never happen. Oh, it's gonna happen my friends. It's going to happen. That was just on a light note, but definitely aging is something that is part of human nature. Uh, your skin has to age and even if you, I mean, you, you don't have to reach like 70 so that you can see the signs of aging. The signs of aging start early and there are things that you can do to prevent it. And our worst enemy when it comes to aging is gravity. So basically your skin is going to be pulled down by gravity. And another enemy is actually um, like overworking your muscles. But we're going to talk about the 10 common things. Common things, by the way. I'm not talking about smoking, see what, no. Just normal, ordinary, common things that people do that are aging their skin faster without them knowing. So let's get into the video. I hope you're going to enjoy it. Don't forget to like, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. The thing that we have to know is that the skin is like an elastic band. So all of these examples I'm going to give you, just remember that the skin is like an elastic band. It stretches and it returns. And the more you stretch an elastic band, the more it loses its elasticity. So the first thing that we're going to talk about, the most common thing that people actually do, and they're not even aware that it causes them to age faster, is hot water. I don't mean like scalding water, but you know nowadays, especially in Kenya, oh my god, to Meletewa Shida, we've been brought for problems. People have hot water showers without regulators, oh my good lord. A hot water shower without a regulator, like seriously, that shower doesn't have any, any as in other temperature other than the one that it has, you can just imagine. So, um... What hot water does is that it causes it causes the skin to wrinkle. So if you're showering frequently with hot water, your skin gets wrinkly, wrinkly, wrinkly. And as you as I've said, it's like an elastic band. So it's going to be like stretching, returning, stretching, returning, stretching, returning, stretching. Yeah, and so on and so forth. And if you do that, the elasticity wears off faster. Pulling your hair too tight. And it's not only Africans. I believe even other races when they put their hairs in ponytails, tight ponytails. You, you, know, you know what I'm talking about, especially if you're a Kenyan. You've gone to the salon, you've put your braids. They've been tightened until your face looks like that of an alien. As in, your eyes are pulled like this, literally. Me, I remember I used to look in the mirror and the first day after I've been braided, I never used to be happy, honestly. Like your face has been pulled so much and especially me, I have a long face. So my face has been pulled back, it's stretched and then like, you you know, they even used to give you painkillers if need be. Like under two meze panadol, just go take some panadols and it will be fine. So your face has been pulled you have to take panadols. Now, what is going to cause that aging is the fact that your skin is being pulled, my friends. Don't, don't put your hair frequently in tight ponytails. If you're a fan of ponytails, make them a bit loose or make them look sleek by maybe gelling them or something, but don't put them in very, very tight ponytails because that is going to make your skin lose its elasticity faster. Improper wash patterns. Washing your face, you know, we are concentrating on the skin of the face because basically if this is a beauty channel What we want to do is prevent the signs of aging Like those fine lines, those what, those, all those things So another thing we really really do is normally to uh, How can I just forget? Let me just read again <clears throat> You know, I have to make notes so Improper wash patterns, yes, improper wash patterns So you're busy there 
pulling your face as we said gravity is one of the most common things that causes aging like it pulls our faces our skins our everything down to towards the ground so when you're aiding gravity maybe you're pulling your face like this you're actually aiding gravity don't pull your face down as you wash it like down no do the opposite pull it up as you wash it or even when you apply oil apply it like this <laughs> i know it's, it looks weird yes but it's going to help you disguise the signs of four this one i'm a victim of <laughs> shouting shouting laughing loud all those things <laughs> especially guys who like hanging out in bars clubs and all those loud things i know right now you can't do that but hey <laughs> that is going to make your skin age those people who laugh loud like me i have those laugh lines and it's because since i was a child i was always laughing like ha, ha, ha. and i was always grinning i can't do that because my teeth are messed up nowadays we don't want to disgust you no 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 so um you you can't nini like if you laugh so loudly with your mouth wide open that's why people who laugh a lot have their lines here and people who frown a lot have their lines here so the faces that you're making are actually going to like um what is it called the faces that you're making i'm going to make you age faster especially if you do them frequently if you crease your brow frequently it, it, it's going to come out faster at a younger age if you laugh out loud it's these lines are gonna come out at a younger age so that's why you find people in their 30s like me talking like yeah uh-huh you know the kardashians and all they talk like that because they don't want their skin to age faster even if maybe yeah they've gone for procedures and all that but it's also because they don't want their skin to age faster so prevention is better than cure don't laugh so loudly don't talk so loudly don't react so dramatically unless you're an actor yeah that is going to actually prevent Another factor that is really, really common uh, that is causing our skin to age is actually not using sunscreen. I know Africans, we like saying we have a lot of melanin, we have a lot of what, we don't need that sunscreen. You need that sunscreen because the sun's rays, UV rays have been linked to so, so many things. It's not only wrinkling, they've been linked to different types of... I know a lot of people are going to say, but <laughs> maybe the cash or whatever, if you don't have sunscreen, you can put on a hat hearts can also prevent that massive hearts they do prevent that so uh aging the sun's rays have been known to cause aging and they make your skin actually look really bad your skin becomes leathery you, you really don't want skin like a cow so if you if you if you don't want leathery skin at a young age avoid going in the sun without sunscreen make sure that you if if you can't afford maybe to buy a cream and at the same time a sunscreen look for a cream that has sunscreen in it or spf in it uh yeah so that is another reason that you might be aging point number six sleeping on your side or on your belly now basically what this is is that you're supposed to sleep while facing up and this is something that honestly even me myself i'm unable to do i can't sleep while facing up you know what happens when you sleep while facing up but the the theory behind this is that when you, you normally see sometimes when you wake up you have lines on your face like the beddings have folded themselves and pressed against your skin and folded your skin in the process that's the theory behind it so basically what you're supposed to do is to sleep while facing up so that your skin doesn't come in contact with material that's going to cause it to fold because those folds are the ones that are going to make your skin age faster so um I hear that if you use silk pillows, I don't own silk, silk pillows, but if you use silk pillows, you it can counter that effect. So instead of using cotton or any other material, just use silk pillows and you can comfortably sleep on your side because it prevents those lines from forming. I know this is so common, like everyone knows you're supposed to drink to do eight glasses of water per day. However, it's so so difficult. Even me myself, I rarely reach those eight glasses of water. But as we know, the skin is like a sponge. It needs in order for it to like be plump and nice and juicy, it has to be like full of water. So if you're taking insufficient water, you're actually not only dehydrating your organs and your blood and everything else, you're also dehydrating your skin. 
so what happens your skin wrinkles it shrinks back which is basically wrinkling and when your skin wrinkles as you know wrinkling back and forth causes loss of elasticity so that is really really bad for your skin so drink plenty of water if you want to come no i mentioned that i will not mention smoking however we cannot you know if you if you if you are talking about aging the things that are causing the skin to age common things we have to put alcohol a lot of people take alcohol and smoke so that is something that you have to look into if you want to prevent early aging if you're worried about aging after all some people are not worried at all which is a good thing it's better than being permanently stressed so if you feel that you're worried that your skin is aging and you smoke and drink of course you just have to find methods of countering that by maybe drinking excess water eating excessively healthy and all that so alcohol and uh cigarette what they also do is that they also dehydrate the body so you might take be taking a lot of water but because you're taking these things they are they are dehydrating your body and therefore dehydrating your skin causing it to age faster guys you have to put moisture into your face if you're washing your face you're actually removing the moisture i know it it's it sounds weird but most of the products we use that we like soap ordinary soap even face washes, whatever, any product that we normally use usually removes the moisture. I know you rinse it with water, but you have to like seal in the moisture and also add more moisture. So moisturizers are just basically creams or lotions or whatever that, ha that are water-based, that are going to add water to your skin. Like that's their purpose. They're going to add water to your skin. So if you're not putting a moisturizer on your face after washing, and by the way, Vaseline is not a moisturizer. Coconut oil is not a moisturizer. Whatever oil that you're putting on your face is not a moisturizer. Those are oils and they add something else. They add nutrients to your skin. They don't add moisture. If you, if you wash your face and you're not moisturizing, that's going to make your skin age faster. Because as I said, if you remove moisture from the skin, you're going to cause it to wrinkle. And if you don't add back that moisture, it will remain in a wrinkled state and then you coat it with Vaseline <laughs> in its wrinkled state. Live in an age where there's moisturizers for different ages. There's moisturizers for like, uh, if you go look at these brands like L'Oreal or Olay or just many, many, many brands, they actually have like age ranges like they have moisturizers for 30 something year olds they have moisturizers for 40 something for 50 something all the way to mature skin and these moisturizers are really really good like they they make your skin look amazing and these serums even this uh what are they called these masks that we are putting like these sheet masks that you wear as a sheet mask <laughs> Those serums, they're designed to add moisture to your skin. So those are all things that you can use to moisturize your face. And there's also other cheaper moisturizers. If you feel that, that those things are a bit too pricey, there are cheaper moisturizers that will do the same job really, really well. So make sure that you're moisturizing your face. If one thing, and this one I also mentioned it in my how, how to get rid of acne video, is exfoliation over exfoliation you know i've noticed that it is so common nowadays nowadays exfoliate uh, these face scrubs not all types of exfoliators these face scrubs are really being marketed as for daily use and in my opinion these things are not supposed to be used daily because uh i have personal experience with this uh, i used a daily use uh, scrub sometimes back the ones that are designed like you can use it as a wash or whatever and it really made my skin look so nice and then after six months of usage my friends my skin became leathery and then i i actually thought about it i was like eh, why is my skin becoming leathery you know these things they do cause micro tears as i said in that make your skin end up looking leathery or feeling leathery so i don't know but that happened to me so i honestly believe that uh, over exfoliation using facial scrubs is actually uh, something that can cause your skin to age faster in terms of its texture not really the way it looks but its texture will age 
and you'll end up looking leathery so that is a factor that you should consider oh i hope that i've taught you something about how you can prevent yourself from your skin from aging faster we all like to look beautiful we all like to look young we all like to look but unfortunately age is not really that kind to the human being maybe in the future it will be far kinder but still as per now even the procedures that people go for in my opinion they just don't look natural like seriously like you look good but <laughs> okay no shade by the no shade to anyone who goes for procedures by the that are supposed to do um like make your your skin look younger However, uh, that was just my personal opinion. Honestly, you guys still look bomb if you've gone for procedures. And uh, what was I saying? God. <laughs> Woo! I should really do a video on how to keep your memory young. So uh, basically, uh, that, that what I was saying is that if you want your skin not to age faster, just look into the 10 things that I've mentioned. And you can also comment down below if you know other things that actually cause your skin to age. Even me, I'm still looking, searching, whatever, food, diet, what, what, what. Comment down below. I'll really appreciate it. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. I post content every week. Yeah, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.